Gents, this is Chris Fry coming at you from Great Escapes RV Supercenter. Ladies and gents, I am standing in front of a 2020 Jayco J Flight SLX 7. This is the 154 BH. This is a bunkhouse floor plan. Uh, this thing is a cozy little camper. It's loaded with all kinds of other cool features and stuff on it. And I just wanted to take a few minutes to show you guys this cool camper. If you guys want to see this in person, you guys can come to our Gasville location at 5750 Highway 62 West here in Gasville. You can give us a call or text at 870-471-9471. Or feel free to check out all of our inventory online at www.rvstobuy.com. That's RVS, the number two. BUY.com. Let's get into this. So, of course, starting out, I always start with the front. Up here, you've got a manual tongue jack. Comes in pretty handy. You've got a 20 pound propane tank, which you fill upon your purchase. You'll also get a battery. Uh, up here on the front, this is a rolled aluminum. It's got a little diamond plate on the front to help with rock chips. It's got a front access window with a nice guard on the front of it as well. It is adjustable. It's got little tabs on the side. You guys can be able to pitch it to any direction that you like. Coming around here, of course, it's got the Jayco's Industries Best two-year warranty bumper to hitch. It's got a nice full span awning on here. Uh, I really like this. Good, good coverage. Uh, it also has a little LED light strip. Good accent light at night. Of course, coming around here, it's got the new key to like locks, which is pretty convenient. So all the keys all match the same locks. Also down here, you see you've got uh, upgraded Goodyear Endurance USA made tires. You've got the upgraded Dexter axles. Still got a good amount of some storage up under here. For a camper this small, it still actually uh, serves pretty well as far as size and features. Uh, of course, a full size spare tire on the back. Uh, you have upgraded LED lights throughout on the side, on the top, and on the bottom. Coming around here, you can see on this side, this is all the additional hookups. Cable t uh, satellite input uh, for your TV on the inside. It's going to be a little 30 amp plug for that. Your hot water heater, city water connection, stuff like this. Guys, this uh, dry weight is actually 2,600 pounds which is really convenient because if you got a small pickup truck or even an SUV that has uh, any sort of a tow rating, uh, you, you'd still be able to pull this uh, fairly easy. Uh, let's go ahead and go inside and look at this a little bit further. Once again, this is the 154BH. So opening up, nice little entryway. Of course, starting in here, what I'll do is I'll stand over in this corner and kind of give you a once over. Let's just see. Kind of take it all in and then I'll start kind of pointing things out. I cover the basics on these RVs. Of course, there's a lot more to know. Uh, you can give any of our sales staff a call at the office and we can explain a lot uh, more in, in, in greater detail. Uh, but this just kind of gets you interested in the RV itself. So starting in the front, of course, a uh, nice little dinette area. As you can see, um, this will actually fold down and this will go completely across and this actually turns into a nice large bed. Um, up on top, you still get a good amount of cabinetry storage. Comes in really handy. It goes pretty deep, actually. It's pretty convenient. Um, like I was telling you, it's got that front windshield. It's got a little guard on the front of it as well, which is pretty cool. You got this as well, some nice privacy shades. Getting into this a little bit further, nice Dometic refrigerator. Let's take a look at that. Pretty cool. It's got a little ice area as well for the freezer. Uh, solid surface look countertops, which is pretty cool. Um, nice little sink, little stove top, um, hood, nice little microwave, additional storage over the sink. I like that this locks into place, so if you're driving down the road, you don't have to worry about those cabinets opening up. Um, it's going to come standard with your wine guard multi directional antenna. It gives you your basics as far as your channels and stuff go. Um, same thing with your radio. A nice little netted area over here to toss in some additional things and not have to worry about them fall out. Of course, you've got a little speaker here as well as a uh, uh, carbon monoxide and smoke detector. Uh, getting into this a little bit further, you see this area is actually set up. You can add in a 12 volt TV and shows all your plugins and there's a 12 volt outlet. Um, this is your thermostat to control your heat and air. This does have the nice AC in it with a built-in heat strip. 
So that comes in really handy and something of this size will actually cool down fairly quick and heat up uh, fairly fast. Keep you nice and toasty for the cold months and same thing for the summertime. Nice cabinetry. A little storage area there as well. You still got a little sound system, sound stream, be able to have music on the inside. I think it says it's set up on the outside as well. Um, of course, awning in and out. Um, your lights for the inside and the outside, and then this is your um, light strip uh, for the awning. Uh, power outlet as well. Um, this is the bunkhouse floor plan, so you guys are going to have two sleeping areas. Uh, this comes in really handy for, you know, uh, mom and dad basically and they got you know two kids or it's one or two people that are uh, wanting to have something like this and then they're wanting additional storage. You're gonna have a 300 pound capacity on top, 600 pound capacity on the bottom but the thing I like the most about this is you can actually take the mattress out and that is all that much more storage. It's got a nice little lipper on here and so you guys can you know get some Tupperware or something from Walmart or Lowe's and have this as storage but not have to worry about it I'm sliding out. Of course, uh, a little bit further, you see more cabinet storage in here as well. Um, that's going to be your manual and information for the coach itself. Coming down here, another section down there. Walking into the bathroom, got a nice setup, a little skylight, uh, faucet. Um, this is actually be a tub combo, so you can do a shower and you have enough room in here to be able to put a tub. So for small kids to be able to wash up, which is pretty cool. Um, a regular size uh, toilet, of course a mirror, you got a little vent here as well, it comes in pretty handy, open that up, keep it nice and aired out of here. Uh, upgraded LED lights throughout, so it's nice and bright, but each one of them are individually operated, so you can turn them all on or you can have one or two on at a time. Uh, be able to do that. Uh, Built-in systems monitor as well. You can press all that. It'll show your tank levels, your gray, your black, all that kind of stuff. Comes in really handy. Let's see what else we got under here. Even more storage, access to all your piping. Really easily accessible. Really cool little camper, just for the size. Quaint. Ladies and gents, my name is Chris Fry. Um, I do a lot of the videos and stuff here. We've got a, a highly skilled sales staff. Uh, we'd love to be able to help you out. Give us a call, give us a text, check out all of our inventory online. We have no documentation or prep fees, less your taxes or if any kind of uh, accessories that you add. Uh, all of our pricing is out the door. We give you a free training class and we also give you a free night stay on a private campground. We'd love to do some business with you. Give us a comment in the section below and uh, let's see if, if we can get you guys into a new RV or a used RV. Thank you all for your time. Have a great day. Headed on down the road On a new adventure Wherever we go Thanks to Great Escapes Great Escapes RV